Now we are live. Are we live? Yes, we are. Sound check. One, two, three. Test, test, test. Can you guys hear us? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hello, everyone, and welcome to our first <coughs> live stream for Nostale. We are so excited. <laughs> we are excited. Is the sound OK for everyone? Nice. So we are at GameForge headquarters in Germany. I am Noemi. I'm the product manager of Nostale. And my nickname is Zoe. I'm Tommy, the QA of Nostale. You probably know me as Jovial. We also have a team behind the screen moderating. So we have Julia, our community manager here and also Chris, our game designer. <laughs> we will be watching the chat. Uh, if you have any questions, we will take some of them and uh, try to answer them. Um, but what will we show today? We will show Act 7, the, the first look on it. Um, I mean, it's worldwide. We are the first having the, 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 the patch. It's the first one. Uh, First one, and it's also worldwide exclusive look at Act 7. Sorry. So when will it be released? We're not going to spoiler you the exact date, but expect it for December. This is also why we're starting off in a Christmassy map in Nosville. Mm -hmm. You can already see there is Christmas decorations and some snow. Drunken snowman. <laughs> <laughs> We will walk you through uh, Act 7. We will show you the maps, the monsters, the raids, of course, the new features, which will be the tattoo system and the rune system, and also just show you some gameplay. All right. So Tommy will be playing, and I will be sitting next to him commenting everything. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's, let's jump right let's to it. Let's start, I think. We're starting directly where you also have to start the quest. There is a new NPC in Port Aveos. I don't know the English name. It's probably it's the, the same, same yeah. probably the same. So why are you walking there? We will be having raffles. You will get codes. We have two different kind of codes. So we have two codes that from NPC Ben. This is where you st start the quest, basically. The thing is, after accepting the quest, you have to go to Act 5, where we have some time now because the ship takes a while. <laughs> one minute. <laughs> one minute? Yes. <laughs> oh, it will leave in one minute. Yeah. So we but can just we can already give you some insight, maybe, about the story of Act 7, in case you're interested. Oh, yeah, Nostail Guildarts. It's the first time we actually do a stream, a live stream for Nostail. But Act 7 is so huge that we thought we really would have to do it. <coughs> There's a lot of different. Don't spoil me. Well, if you, you don't want to be spoiled, <laughs> you should leave the stream right now because we will spoiler everything. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> OK, let's jump while we wait a bit into the story of Act 7. So basically, it's a whole new chapter. It's a whole new world. Uh, we will be traveling to an island far away uh, called Mauritius. And there is a new tribe, a new NPCs, uh, the Orc tribe, and you will travel to the island to help them. I will give you some more insights about this as we go. Who are you? Someone was telling me. <laughs> <laughs> are we going to play? Well, playing through the whole Act 7. That will take a That while. would take some time, so it's not going to be a 24-hour stream or anything. Uh, yes, we will consider to do other live streams. Actually, once we drop Act 7, we thought we will do a stream right then and there. This means that uh, when you join the servers to have the first look at Act 7, we will be there with you on the live servers and stream a bit. So, well, we arrived there, going to tell, uh, talk with the first Orc here, the new NPC. So it's telling you a bit about the story, the problems the orcs have there. In the beginning, they not really trust you, so you have to gain their trust. We don't want to spoil too much of the story, I think. 
So this orc you're talking to, well, I'm going to spoil a bit now, okay. is a refugee <laughs> of the island Mauritius, where the tribe lives. And he came to our world and our maps to ask for the support of the adventurer because they are facing big <coughs> issues on the island. Yes, we will show you the equipment later. Oh, on the ship you can already see some of the new monsters. You can even fight there if you want. You can fight them? Just to try. Merlin. Uh, please note that the balancing of the monsters is not final yet, so we're still working on that. Yeah. Maybe should we turn on the music? Is it not turned on? Oh, no, we can turn on the music. Yeah. Those poor whirlings. Why are you dying? <laughs> are they too strong? Or are you too weak? I'm too weak. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Welcome to Act 7, guys. Yeah, it's a completely different look now. We are having the yeah another island now, basically. So you land at the beach. Which looks awesome. Yeah. In my eye. Even the details there, some... Little yeah, I think the maps... I think Antwil did a really good job with the maps. I think they look very pretty yeah. for Act 7. Compared to Act 6. <laughs> They can't hear the soundtrack. <coughs> Let's try it like that. Get that quest out. So what Ant will also added now is some awakening experience or champion experience to the quests. So you can actually level that more by doing quests. Also, you will see that later by daily quests. Yeah, AXP is, I mean, Antwerp called it Awakening Experience, but we are calling it Champion Experience. <laughs> but the pictures are not translated, that's why it's still AXP. <coughs> so we're showing you Act 7 right now, but what you don't know yet is that we will also do changes to Act 6 very important changes I think that you will enjoy while leveling and progressing through the game. We will give you more input on this a bit later. Just to spoil you a bit, we heard your feedback and tried to yeah, basically do the most of the stuff there. Yeah, so to the, together with Act 7, Act 6 changes will be implemented. Again, the Merling. <laughs> Poor there. Yeah, true. The, the maximum awakening level or champion level it will be 60. So it will be increased by 10 levels. Yeah, new drops, that's true. We have a lot of new drops here. Basically, almost every monster is dropping something new. And also the Christmas stuff. <laughs> oh, the Christmas event stuff, yeah. Yeah. So please note that the Christmas event will start together with Act 7. Currently I'm not getting that much experience because I'm level 58 already, so it will take a while. But as we said, the monsters are not completely balanced yet, so the experience can also change. So Clouds are about the balance patch. We are already discussing balancing changes and we would like to have it early next year. <coughs> yes, 
You think it's time for the first code? Yes, it is. <laughs> I think it's we time for the first code. So, we will be dropping the first code that everyone can redeem uh, in the Nosmo uh, in the chat. So, please drop the first code. Code, code, code. <laughs> oh, I died. Guys, if you spam the chat so much, the code will be gone. <laughs> Can you just activate it on the screen? Yeah, which one is it? The you got a friend in me. So, well, it's not very that visible. Woohoo! <laughs> Okay, so the first code you can redeem in the Nosmall is you got a friend in me. You have to sing it while entering it. <laughs> I'm singing it because I'm not entering it. Uh, you can redeem it. You need to go into the game, open the Nosmall and go into the Nosmall settings. And in the Nosmall settings, it says redeem code. Just drop it in there. Don't worry. Uh, this will be redeemable until end of December. Yeah, the max level will be plus 60 for awakening level. My god, those are so annoying. <laughs> what do you mean, no small died? Maybe too many users are trying to enter in the corner. Maybe. <laughs> but like I said, don't worry, it's redeemable until December. Um. Just wait a bit, there's probably a lot of people trying to access it right now. How many are watching? <laughs> <laughs> Show us some different monsters, Tommy. Yeah, no. it's probably easier. <laughs> Zoom out a bit. Oh, there. Siren. Yeah. Yeah, did all, you, all the you... monsters are here. Yeah, I'm wanted because I have God oh, mode. Oh, you have God mode on. A we... bit faster. Because I have to kill 10 of them and 20 of the others. Show us, yeah. Talk about a bit about the uh, effects of these monsters and you have them open already. Would you say they're strong compared to Act 6? Currently they're similar. they're similar to Act 6, I would say. But as we said, we will still work on the balance. So don't worry that it's too easy, but also not too strong. We try our best there. What I like is that Entwell added an effect to the little Merlings, that they are summoning a little Merling, small Merling around. Oh, I didn't even see chance. that. I was watching the chat, ch yeah. chat so much that I didn't even see the... Well, now you have god mode, so you will probably not. Can you deactivate it? I want to see the little Merlin. Let's try it. I'm not sure. <laughs> just, just don't die. You, 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 don't have even have, you don't have potions, do you? Yeah. Now we might see them. They all have aggro? Um, in the start map, like here, we added some monster aggro to the scorpions. They are just there on top of the map. And the little merlings and the sirens don't have auto aggro, just if you attack one of them, then they are follow uh, following their friends. But on the other maps, everyone has auto aggro, so it's easier for the players to farm them. There, to farm yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. Because that was also a wish from Act 6, because there was not like that everywhere. Should we spoil a bit the Act 6 changes? You guys want to hear about that? Probably. You can do that while I'm dying. <laughs> yes, I am exactly dead, Zoe. The pigs were named after me after April 1st. That is <laughs> very true. 
No, no, no. Okay, that is the first change of Act 6. I can see that you're very interested in the changes we made to it. So actually, we lowered the entry level of Act 6 to 85. So you will already be able to enter Act 6 with level 85, so you can start leveling your hero XP or champion XP uh, earlier. In addition, we increase the amount of monsters you can farm. And the change you said what about the uh, difficulty of the Act 6 monsters. Yeah, what we did, we, um, as she said, we increased the monsters on the maps. Like there were, I think, two maps where the players were, I don't know, the, the favorite maps where the players were leveling. We changed the amount of monsters to basically almost the same on all the maps. So you can hopefully level everywhere. And what we also did is we decreased the level of the monsters by five as well. So it's easier to start leveling champion level. Since we decreased the entry level to 85, we also had to decrease the monster level a bit. Yeah. But this means, you know, gaining hero or champion XP will be made much easier for you guys. The experience you're still gaining there is basically almost the same from the monsters. That was not changed at all. Guys, don't worry about the Nosmo. You can redeem the code until the end of December. So write it down in case, because we will not be displaying it the whole stream, because we have different codes that we will show you. <coughs> What's interesting about Act 7 in addition is the entry level is also at... The entry level is... Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Awakening level 10 is needed for Act 7. So you have to go to Act 6 a bit to level there. And then you but the only through. until champion level 10 so make sure you already start leveling in case you're not champion level 10 so you will be ready to go to act 7 once we drop it to life they're so cute i love them <laughs> click on them because i like them they're so yeah. cute we won't kill them <laughs> fun, fun fact about the picanhas you will actually be able to get a pet from the normal quest line yeah. After finishing the whole quest line, which is huge for X7, you will get a Picanha pet and also a new title, which was implemented. Would you say X7 is bigger or smaller or the same size as X6? I mean, as you can see on the map, it's bigger than X6 part one, actually. Or not almost the same, but for X6, it was all the maps were the same size and the angel and the devil side were the same. So it's a lot of difference here, yeah. Can you scroll out and show the map a bit? Okay, so they ha all have ag aggro here. Yeah, on, on all the other maps, except for the start maps that we, you have auto aggro everywhere. So be prepared. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, we are cheating, but we are allowed to. <laughs> <laughs> so where are those orcs? When do we get to see them? I mean, will it take long to see them? We have seen already some of them, yeah. but we will also show you the village of them, where they are living. I mean, maybe you can tell something about the story, the sad story of the orcs. The sad story? Yeah. Why you defeat some of those pretty cute monsters? I will give you a bit of bit of input about the story of Act Seven. So, what happened to the island of Mauritius? Uh, the orc tribe lives there, and they were hit by a big drought, meaning the crops were dying, there was no water, and the chief of the orcs of the tribe. Uh, called all his orc mages and said please perform the magic and we need to find out the prophecy to make our situation better so when they did that the prophecy said we would have to build a sky tower that pierces the sky this is why the update is called orcs and the sky tower and so when they did that you know building the tower took a long time many orcs died and the situation just didn't get better so some of the orcs decided to flee the island and to look for help. This is where 
they found us, the adventurer, and asked for our help. By the time we get there by ship, you know, we sail to the west, where the island Mauritius is. Uh, we get there and everything is weird with the tribe. So they actually built a tower and the chief of the tribe uh, pierced the sky with his spear and monsters starting coming out of that hole. And a big boss, a big evil creature came out and devoured uh, the chief. So the chief uh, of the tribe, the old chief, transformed into a big monster. And we are here now, the adventurers, to help the orc tribe and to defeat the All chief the monsters, yeah. and the monsters, <laughs> right. So this is the story, basically, of Act 7. You can see already some we not dead, <gasps> but... <laughs> we are here, look at that. Around it. So this is what's left of the orc tribe. <laughs> not many. <laughs> but we are there to help them, or you are there to help them. Right. So this is the new hub of Act 7. This is where you'll be talking to your NPCs. There is the rainbow shop. Open the shop. What's in there? It's the same as always. Nothing. We didn't change something yet on the rainbow crystal shop. There will might be some changes in the future. And you have daily quests everywhere. You have sub quests everywhere. So in Act 7 you will have a lot of stuff to do. And as I said, also the daily quests are giving awakening experience, which was wished by the community. Go a bit more into... Ah, I want to see orc tribe because this is sad that map yeah we don't want to go there <laughs> so for anyone who it's was okay. not here from the very beginning we are gameforge we are publishing nostale in europe and north america and we are showcasing act 7 the brand new update dropping in december this is world exclusive now what we're showing and the update is called orcs and the sky tower and it's a completely new island with new features we're showing you today. We will be raffling many codes. So stay with us and you might be able to get some really, really cool goodies. That's the Sky Tower, by the oh, way. Oh, that's you the Sky Tower. See? It's the part of it. <laughs> it's really big. Actually, we will have two updates for Act 7. Yeah. So this one that's dropping the biggest part will be Act 7 Part 1. But we will introduce Act 7 Part 2 in 2020. This is where you will be able to even enter the Sky Tower. Show us a real class. Swordsman is a real class. Swordsman <laughs> is my is my favorite class. What are you talking you about? You have to change. <laughs> Look at the crops. Yeah, here they are still okay, but... <laughs> <laughs> I like what Antwil did with the maps this time. I think they look really, really cool. Yeah. Really cute. I like it. What are those monsters, those flying ghosts called? Revenant. Mm -hmm. And Warrior Troll. <laughs> the Warrior Troll? Can yeah. you zoom in? I can't see. I need my glasses. <laughs> oh. But the Picanha is my... F What's your favorite monster? The Picanha. Like seven. The Picanha. I like that little wobbly thing, that pudding. What is it? Is it called pudding? Um, I think the yes. little green one. Let's go there. <laughs> Pudding. There you have them. Oh yeah, there it is. It's called Moss Gloop. The I think it was called Pudding by Antwerp <laughs> when they send it to us. I actually like pudding. <laughs> oh, they're also cute. Not after fighting. Oh, them. you already killed it. There's still it? one. Not the rock golem. That one looks mean. We do, we do, we do. <laughs> 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 they're also cute, the little fairies. The moss fairies. In case you're wondering about our headpieces. It's orc style, you know? <laughs> we look like the tribe. I think you have god mode activated. Can you click on that little bumpy thing? Moss Ferry. This is actually one of the prettiest maps, right? It's so it's awesome. It's one of man. the prettiest maps of Act 7. If you do that. A 
someone is laughing there from behind. <laughs> the moderators are laughing for some reason. So yeah, I will switch a character now to have or to also show the other classes and also the we have all the classes prepared. Yeah. yeah. So we showed you some of the maps already. There will be seventeen new maps with Act Seven, and uh, you can explore them all, see all the monsters, fight them all, level your level and hero level or champion level we call it. Yeah. Everyone's favorite class. I've seen the chat, <laughs> right? <laughs> Archer, yeah! <laughs> Nerf Archer, Best okay. class, Nerf Archer. We know, we know. Talk to P Picky Deer. Did you come up with those names? Picky Deer. No. <laughs> <laughs> So the orc NPCs, you saw, saw some of them already. We have 40 new orc NPCs. And we also have a lot of different monsters. Will daily quests give hero XP? Yes, some of them. Isn't there all also titles, right? You can get or not. Is there? <laughs> Hey, game designer back there. <laughs> Can you get titles somewhere? From the new race? One. One t okay. quest? Ah, in the main quest. Yeah. So, we just got confirmation you can even get a title if you go through the main quest. Yeah, of that's Act that's what I told before, yeah. <laughs> Not sure if I have it. No, the I two don't. system. We will show you the systems, don't you yes. worry. <laughs> and also the equipment. The monsters, we have 50 new monsters and bosses. And I think next up, we should also, maybe we should showcase a bit the new equipment. What do you think? Yeah, sure. Should not? we go? I mean, we. I think we just spoiled the weapons so far, not the armors and so on. Did you? Oh yeah, we should show it, yeah, all of it. Is this, which one of the new ones is it? It's completely mixed. So it's mixed? It's, yeah. Okay. <laughs> It's the high level uh, armor, it's the mid level okay. dagger, and the lowest. We ones. will have three new main weapons, three new secondary weapons, and three new armors. In addition to, you know, two new, a uh, lot of new accessory. So, new helmets, gloves, shoes, etc., rings, bracelets, all that you can farm in the game. Tell us a bit about what you're showing us. The cool new effects for the armors, for example, are that they are spawning monsters around you with a 2% chance if you are hit by monsters or other players and they will fight for you. I can maybe show them to you, hopefully. Legendary plus 10. Yes. You know how yeah, to roll. <laughs> <laughs> I had to raid a lot for that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the monster to spawn from the from the armor, but just a two percent chance. So that could take a while. Yeah. Our heads blocked the weapon effects. Oh, true. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> uh, can you like uh, take the, the code away from the screen yeah, sure. for now? Yeah, maybe I can show the monster later when it spawns during during some raids. I mean, I can probably show one to you now. The code, we will also post them later on social media and everywhere, in case you missed it. That's the weapon again. But as I said, that's the lowest weapon of all of the three. 
Yes. You can also get new skills, right? Five, five new passive skills? Oh yeah, we have those books like we had in Act 6 where you need Awakening level 4 or Champion level. Um, that basically increases your um, stats like HP, MP and so on. So it's passive skills? Yeah. yeah. But for active skills we will have something else. <laughs> Are you talking about the new features by yeah, any chance? <laughs> ah, there okay. was a monster. Oh, where, 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 where? I almost spawned a monster. It was running somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> I missed it. Hmm. It's probably afraid. Looking ah, there it is. There it is. The dragon. Oh demon. my god. It's fighting for huh. me. Level 99. Nice. Actually, sometimes I'm looking at some nodes oh, no. and I'm missing stuff. What did no, you do? I have no arrows. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we switch the class now to the mage <laughs> and show the mage weapon too. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. No cursing on stream. <laughs> see, they want to see the mage. The mage is the best class anyway, in my opinion. <laughs> So they're asking, I think, if it will be easier or better to farm a hero or champion XP in Act 7 compared to Act 6. Mm, as we said, it will be easier in Act 6 because we lower the level, but the experience is the same. So also, even with higher level, you can go there and level and getting the same amount as before, just the monsters are easier to kill. And Act 7 is not fully decided yet. The game designer could maybe tell something, but in the end, it should probably... I don't know. Ah, yeah, true. The monsters are giving more XP, but also they are harder to kill. So Act 7 monsters give more XP generally than Act 6. Show equipment, too. Yeah. I'm just I'm waiting for you to run somewhere pretty. I realize we're looking in different directions because I have a screen there and you have one here in case you guys <laughs> are wondering. <laughs> so we're getting some community questions dropped. What is the recommended level to enter Act 7? What would you say? For now, since the monsters are not decided, it's hard to say. Currently, it's also like before, it's like 88 or 90. But I think in the end, it will probably be like that, yeah. Because Act 6 was lowered now, that lower players could actually level there. And Act 7 will be like Act 6 before, maybe a bit higher. Especially also because the rates are really hard sometimes or the higher rates but yeah let's do one i would say already no the raid yeah let's do it let's show a raid which one do you want to show so we have three new raids with act seven we will with show the Kirola, it's called. Kirola. so three new monsters boss monsters raid monsters to battle this is where you'll be farming your important stuff for your equipment and gear. <laughs> not so easy, huh? No, it's not. Are you doing the raid by yourself? I have God to, no, there's no one else to play with true. me. <laughs> I'm just sitting here commenting everything. Before you do that, yes. I think it's time for some codes. What do you say? Do we have more there? Of course. <laughs> I think we should raffle some of the codes that are single use, mm -hmm. meaning you will have to write something in the chat to enter the raffle. We need to move to the giveaway. Yeah. You can see that, right? Okay, guys. You, <laughs> you can get a code with something very exclusive. We have some pets. 
<laughs> they already started. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second. Okay, <laughs> if we click now on no, start, start listening, listening chat. chat, you start writing raffle in the chat. Go. See, now all of your names are appearing. Oh my God. Okay, roll it. <laughs> click roll. Stop it. First. Stop. Okay, roll. Smirix, congratulations. You have won a single code. Click on roll. To where? Open links. True Lex, congratulations. You have also won a code. You don't have to write it in the chat anymore. Oh, you don't have to write <laughs> raffle anymore. This round is gone. <laughs> roll again. Ichi, Ichiru, congratulations, you have won a code. Roll again. True Lex again. Again? <laughs> Happy you <laughs> or lucky no. you. Okay, next one. Roll that. Promethean, you have also won a code. Let's roll some more. Look, they're all into it. They're still writing raffle even though it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Yumi Kaze. Congratulations. One more? One more. Je suis un... I can't I pronounce think that's that. a French name. <laughs> <laughs> this sounds French. Let's roll one last one for now. Last one. Last one. For now, princess. princess. Oh, I oh. like that. <laughs> Just like decision. me, <laughs> I'm the princess. Okay. Thanks, guys. You will be contacted by our moderators who are watching the chat, and they will give you a code. Please stop writing raffle. <laughs> we, <laughs> we will tell you again when to write it. <laughs> <laughs> Or just keep spamming. That's also fine for me. Okay. So now that we have raffled it, let's go into the raid. Which one is it you said? Cor Corilla? Kirolla. That's Kirola. the middle. We have three raids. It's a more or less simpler one, um, middle, mid hard one, ah, and, a, and a really hard mm. one. This raid is for eight members. I'm trying the best to do it alone. <laughs> oh, you have God mode, right? Not yet. <laughs> Or show a bit, yeah, what it's doing. Yeah. I'm not even dealing damage, as you can see. One. <laughs> and I die. Oh. <laughs> well. Wait. When that happens, I have an idea. Do you hit me with something? <laughs> yeah. We are the orcs. Every time you die. Ow. <laughs> you get that. So let's do it again with God mode. Before you kill it, maybe show a bit what it's doing and stuff. Yeah. yeah. But with God mode, I will live a bit longer and won't be hit again. Mm. <laughs> we will also show the swordsman equip a bit later. Don't worry. Yeah. What does it do? Okay. So some pretty strong debuffs, huh? It's also spawning some monsters, oh, yeah. which you have to defeat, and a lot of meteors. <laughs> I like meteors. Did you know we can spawn meteors with GM commands and then we cannot remove them unless we do a server maintenance? <laughs> I learned the hard way because yes. I once spawned meteors in Moscow. So what can you get from this raid once you finish it? Um, all the three raids are containing equipment and also a lot of material for rooms and can you also Can you also craft the equipment? Um, the higher equipment has to be crafted out of the low level equipment. Mm. So you have to farm it first, can wear it if you want, and later you can craft the high equipment out of it. Even with God mode, it's pretty strong. <laughs> he looks pretty cool. Yeah. Looks like they upped the animation a bit for the uh, for the bosses, for the raid monsters, or monsters in general. This is the middle one. The small one is the, the, the dog, right? Yeah. 
it's a dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, no it's, it's a lion, is it? With, yeah. with wings? Something like that. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, with the codes we're raffling, okay, so the codes that everyone can use. So the you got a friend and me gives you some consumables, some potions and stuff. And the single ones, they give you some exclusive pets. I will have a look for you. The peas, for example. Hmm? Okay, so the ah, what you just got, the codes that we raffled to like six of you, you get a seedle pet. This pet you can not obtain otherwise unless we give it to you or raffle. But we have some more coupons that include the tropical costume set, baby dunder pet, Boeing pet, the walker pet, the fire wampy pet, and uh, Leo the coward pet, the little turtle. Oh, you, you won? I did it, yeah. See, I was talking so much you didn't even see. <laughs> okay, so what is dropping before you pick it up? You have a lot of materials for runes and tattoos and also gold again of course and you're how getting a rate box how much gold 35 35,000 10 times what is that or or and, all that or and everything is for runes and tattoos ah. also the rate boxes are containing their stuff oh did you got like a rare five one right yeah what was in there i didn't see that was also material for yeah for runes Oh, the lower. We will jump into the new features very soon, but I heard some people also wanted to see the swordsman equipment. Mm -hmm. So before we jump into the new features, we will show you the swordsman stuff. I will show this one again first. Uh, which, we, which one are these? Are they mixed again? Mm, we have two high level ones yeah. or mid level ones. The high level ones are for awakening level 60, so you have to get the max level. And that's a mid level or low level one even. You can see here, oh yeah, of course. I, have, I have the new title here, that's the savior of the orcs. If you finish the main quest, you will give, get that. Did you also equip the martial artist? Yes, of course. We will <laughs> also show the martial artist. We won't forget about it. <laughs> I wasn't there where you created, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> so let's, let's show the swordsman again. Let's show swordsman and then of course, the last but not least, the martial artist. I get a sip out of That's my cool. Nostail mug. Cheers to that. <laughs> oh no, I'm The graphics it. are great. They're awesome. They're timeless. Nostalgic. <laughs> Nostal Ooh. Good job. We have also new resistance, which is not the real values now. I changed them a bit to have Oh, that's the real value, actually. You have two times 20%. Don't put it in behind our heads. <laughs> it's not, it's directly between, it's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and also the high-level crossbow again, the high-level armor. Oh, no, it's also the mid-level, and the mid-level is more. Let me see. Legendary. All element energies are increased by 190 increases damage with a probability of 40% by 40% and a debuff for the enemy. No second soft crit, yeah. <laughs> that's true. But we know about the problems. That's what Noemi said before about the balancing. We will touch it. Oh yeah. Uh, we did a lot of balancing changes for this update. So when we first initially got it from Antwil, we decided to do a lot of modifications together with them. They were willing to do so. So we hope it will drop to you in the best possible balancing. And if something is off with the balancing, we will polish definitely afterwards. Because of course we're looking at it with many QAs and many time invest, but you of course will find more than we can. No. Yes, we will show some time spaces too. Oh, true. Time spaces. Oh. Let's go into the. Let's not forget the martial artist, and then we go into time space. Oh, can we see the wolf helmet? Yeah, we'll show it with the martial artist. The what? The wolf helmet. Ah, one. yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, a new item. It blocks basically bad effects. 
we have nice music again. <laughs> Let's <laughs> leave this map. <laughs> Why we're on the ship, we should raffle some codes. What do you think about that? I like it. It's also awesome. I think players also like it. You wanna have some codes? Did we change the music? Okay. Yeah, the thing is with Act 6, they started to make the music a bit not so loud, so... Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, are we on the ship? Are we s yes. starting? Oh, yes. Okay, we will raffle the next codes. They're already writing in the channel. Raffle again. Uh, change to the giveaway screen, please. Yes, we empty the list again. Okay, start listening, chat. Okay, go. go. Write, raffle, 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 raffle. 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 <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. Okay, now stop. Roll, roll, roll. Ricky Marty, congratulations. Mm -hmm. Roll again. Damien Marie, you got a code. Or you get one. Roll again. Wider149, also got a code. Roll again. They're still writing raffle. <laughs> well, they will never stop. <laughs> Aldavav? Aldavav. 22. 22. <laughs> That's important. <laughs> <laughs> again? Let's do it again. We have some more codes. Fatalist free. Let's do it again. Wow, that is... I cannot pronounce it. That sounds like a Tra Czech or Tra Russian Tra name. Tra Sorovsky? Tra Sorovsky. Right. One more time, one more time. And go. Waika, Waikild. Congratulations, you're the last one for this round. But well, don't worry, we have way more codes that we will raffle throughout the stream. Okay. The ship is still not going. Hmm. We well, then start. roll another one. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Why How long not? is the time? That's the Where's the... Oh, it doesn't say so. Uh, I'll do another giveaway then. Okay. One more. Roll. They're still writing. No, we still use the old list, so you don't have to write it. <laughs> Stop writing it. <laughs> Rumo 177. Congratulations. Okay. That's it for this round. So, maybe we can have a look a bit at the equipment while we are still yeah. uh, waiting. So, also, so the martial is artist is also spawning a monster around you. That's really cool. So, it's basically increasing your own damage your own attack and also always has a debuff connected to it is that correct the thing is currently oh yeah they changed it to the main weapon the main weapon has a bad effect there where you in or a good effect for you actually this is very funny can you open maybe we have another uh, question from the community in there do we? So. Mm. Ah, the seals, the raid seals. Ah, yeah, the raid seals, yeah, right. Yeah. In the beginning, it was like that, that they were dropping everywhere, but we thought that might be a bit boring for you. I mean, it was like that in Act 6 already. We change it now that you can farm the seals in front or on the map where you can start the raid as well. So you can prepare there with your team and farm the seals. Um, and in time spaces, and right? we also added the time spaces. You, ha you have some smaller versions of the monsters there, of the raid bosses. Mm -hmm. How and about if you defeat them, there is a high chance to drop the raid seal. Oh, good. Maybe we should jump into a time space once we waited sixty seconds. We can also go there. Then, <laughs> mm, you cheat your way to Mauritius. If I find the right, yes. We even have a time space here directly. What level is it? We change levels also to 85 because you can enter Act 6 or also Act 7 with level 85. In Important. In Entry level for both Act 6 and Act 7 will be level 85. 
But the only difference, yeah. the champion level has to be 10 for Act 7. Hmm. Let's do a time space. <laughs> <laughs> Stop writing GM cheat codes <laughs> to see for everyone. Some players know them anyway. <laughs> because it's not my first time. Okay, so South Beach Cave. Is this the first time space in Act 7? Yes, it is. Okay. But I cannot enter it with this character because I did not do the quest. Well, we change the character then. Let's do it. Oh. I can. I don't even know those new commands. They're not new. <laughs> huh. How old? I mean, you know when I was doing that stuff. Ten older. years ago. Older. I'm old. I've yeah, been doing Nostale for ten years, eleven almost. In a cave now in this time space, so oh. they also adjusted the maps. <laughs> How's the sound? Is it too loud? No. Okay. Hmm? That's good. Oh, that that music and the time space is so nostalgic to me. Yeah. Oh. I love it. Maybe we will That's drop. That's square. Yes, we know there are still some bugs which will be fixed under the release, of course. Which one? The red square, which you can see there when I'm attacking the little merman. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's yeah. right. We will get some patches before we drop this on live. Don't worry. And the old bear is spawned now by my equipment, so he's fighting for oh, me. Oh, this is yours. Yes, it's mine. Oh my god, he's so cool. Oh, he died. We but there's give, another one. We should give this one out as a pet. <laughs> He's also dealing a lot of damage, as you can see. Oh yeah, that's true. So yeah, you don't have any pets and partners with you. I just saw that. Yeah. So you have your pet, your partner, and you even spawn a monster. This is exclusive for the new Act Seven. Yes. Equipment. equipment yeah. that's really cool. So maybe we will even drop a raid seal. There is one. I see it. But it's from another raid. <laughs> oh, okay. No, here's, in this time space, there is no boss, so you, we won't drop a raid seal here. Ah, it's only from the... Oh, I see. The merge. Guys, we are talking about the merges. I know it's a huge topics for you, topic for you guys, and I promise this will happen next year, but we have some technical difficulties. Currently, we cannot merge different countries with each other without shutting down the language or the localization of it. So we requested a multi-language client from Antwerp, which will make stuff like this way easier. Ruffle, ruffle. Merge UK. Merge U It's always ruffle, ruffle, merge UK. <laughs> uh. I'll... Uh, Aldabav, your code will be sent to you. You will get a private message by our moderators and in Twitch. I think you should have received it now. Okay, we got another question. How many time spaces will will there be? Do you know? This should be written on your hopefully. I didn't write it down, so I, I have don't no know idea. out of my head. No. <laughs> okay, wait. <laughs> wait, so wait, we can check. The lowest level is We have ten time spaces. Okay, ten time spaces. And all of them with different monsters. You can even level in there if you want. Do you still lose hero XP when dying in F7? Yes. So don't die like Tommy does. Otherwise, no Amy will come with the thing again. To oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm prepared for that. <laughs> We are one hour into the stream. I think it's time for the whenever you're done defeating, otherwise, you will die Probably. for the next code that everyone can redeem. Never mind, the no small is a bit laggy. We will go with single codes again. Don't you're already starting writing raffle. It's not time yet. I should I just should just not mention raffle. <laughs> Don't say this word. 
Wow, the chat is too, too fast. I cannot follow. Yeah. The mods will tell us if something interesting is in there. Just Something with shells. Just don't die. Yeah. Okay. Next to the time spaces, we found out it's going to be 10. There's also a lot of new quests you will be able to do. So the main quest will be a total of 130 quests. I wrote this down. I have my notes. And we have a total of 34 new subquests. Plus 45 new daily quests. That's even more because Ant will added, added some afterwards. They have a oh, better story. So, so even more. Yeah. I'm in the next room now. Hope that's okay. <laughs> yeah, so the next SP will not be part of Act 7 Part 1. But there is a new SP already planned. Yes, we will do balancing changes to classes and specialist cards and equip was the question yeah that too the soft crit stuff if we touch the balancing then we have to check everything of course that's the thing we it's uh, the changes are of course dangerous and we have to look at everything at the same time this is why we haven't done it yet So if Tommy manages to get through this time space today, <laughs> oh good, we can do a new rep. Oh no, I'm not done. <laughs> no cursing. You said it again, Ruffle. <laughs> ruffle, ruffle, ruffle. I'm so sorry. They're not. They're already writing. That's okay. Okay. Another raffle for some codes. Giveaway. Let's go. So, empty the viewer list. Okay. And start. Right. Raffle, 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 raffle. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> Let's wait some more. Yeah, I think the chat is a bit slow here. <laughs> Isn't it cute? The bushy even has a headpiece. Yeah. These are rare. Tommy has like three. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you can show the other one. It's made by a player. Oh, yeah. Look, I have a, a little jelly made for me for my birthday. I know they don't care about this. They just want the codes, right? Yeah. Ruffle, okay, ruffle, stop ruffle. listening, <laughs> chat. Guys, you can stop now. We will roll the winners. Roll it. Dove's cash. Dove's Dave's cash. Congratulations, you won a coat, probably a pet. Roll again. Princess. Princess again. again. Oh. Are you cheating this somehow? I think so. Roll it's again. It's a cute name. <laughs> Essen style. Essen, Essen style. Congratulations, you won a coat. Roll. Ex Garius. Garius. Garagi. I will just stop trying to pronounce this. Roll again. Spiegelkammer. You e pronounced missing. this wrong, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> but you still want to go. Congratulations. Roll again. It's like the TV show. I will buy an E. <laughs> I will buy an Iros X. Congratulations. You want to go. Let's do another one. Come on. Mdaidor. 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 <laughs> okay. You won as well. Okay. Last one. We're rolling. Last one. And go. And go. Nesrin 2001. Wow, you're Congratulations. young. Congratulations. Congratulations. This is I it. This already. And back to the main screen. Okay. How about we show the new features? Should we? Yes, we should. Should we <laughs> go into rune system or to two system first? What do you guys care most about? Switch the character again for that. You care most about the raffle. <laughs> I get it. Raffle, <laughs> raffle, raffle. We should just do one live stream for two hours and just raffle a yeah. code every 10 seconds. 
I think that would increase the view count of Twitch. Tattoo rune, tattoo rune. Where is the code? You will get the code. You will be contacted via private message on Twitch. On the website. Since we're doing this manually, please wait until you're contacted. You can redeem the code in the not small if it's working already. Uh, <laughs> by going into the settings and clicking on redeem code. Oh, they want to see the wolf helm. Oh, they oh, have yeah. it. Oh, can you, uh, do you have one? You're wearing yeah. it. Can you s scroll in? Yeah. That's it. So pretty. The ancient beast helmet. Yes, the monsters will be easier to kill in Act 6 once Act 7 drops. We lowered the entry level to Act 6 to make it more enjoyable for you. And so you can start leveling your champion or hero XP earlier. It will be easier to kill the monsters and we will even increase the amount of them. Yeah, And the XP, as we said, the experience there will stay the will same the as before. Yeah, will stay the same. For some of you, it's maybe even better because the there's no level gap anymore, so you're getting the full experience from the monster. Yeah, so it should be way more enjoyable for you yeah. after this so what drops. Did the users decide runes or tattoos? Let's go for runes. Okay. Rune system. So we're now showing you one of the brand new system introduced in Act Seven, the rune system. What this does, you can carve runes into your weapon i don't have the materials now because i didn't farm them <laughs> can you create them do you have the ids not really mm. but we can i think do the quests they give us the needed amount or we can just farm it after so we can create it. so until then, we can talk a bit about the rune system, I would say. So you can add runes to your weapon up to level 15, right? Yes. The rune. And what's interesting is that when you upgrade the rune uh, in your weapon, uh, every five levels, something happens, right? It There's a special rune power on it. Every t three levels, not five. Uh, three levels, that's yeah. correct. So in total five, but every three levels, so that's three yeah, times so five, so 15. So whenever one of those five grades, every three level is um, reached, you will get a new ability. We will try to show this to you. The max of rune is 15. But it's not just the abilities you reach. You can also get the rune power, right? Yeah, that's what I said. I mean, with every upgrade level, you're getting the normal rune ability. Yeah. And with every three levels, you will get or have the chance, a really high chance, to have a special ability, the, the rune power. There's 10 different types of rune powers you can get. And you can have two rune powers, I think, at the same time. I think it take, uh, will take a while. Can you drop us the IDs of the material, please? We'll try to speed this up for you, if we can. Need some support from our dear helpers behind the screen. <laughs> might, take, might take a second. If it, takes, if it takes more than two minutes, we will do a raffle again. Again. 
I, I mentioned Raffle once and look at that. Don't <laughs> say it again. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> right click on it. On what? On the NPC? The material? Oh yeah, there's the, the pet. I can show you. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, everyone wants to see the pet. Oh, that's really cute. You can even see them in the in the village here from the orcs. They are also having some of the becomers. Oh, where are they? They are hidden a bit. Ah, uh, they're so cute. They are tamed. <laughs> they're very cute. Yeah. <laughs> you can also have one of them. Just do the main quest until the end. Level one. It's Me. not really powerful. It's more just to have a cute pet there. But it doesn't show the pet. It, I only see. Okay, okay. Can you move away? It's the pet. No, no. I mean, oh, you're move. standing in front of it. New chicken, yeah, basically. <laughs> Someone said it's not cute. Wow. I think you should be banned no, <laughs> from the no chat. No raffle for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's a creepy crow, by the way. Oh my god. There's just one in the whole Act 7. And it's not and moving. It's, yeah, it's not moving and staring at you. Fun fact is that the map was changed now, the village. I think the main story was planned differently before because mm -hmm. you could see some skeletons into uh, in the street. Oh, they removed the skeletons? Yeah, they changed it to Why? mushrooms now. But the creepy crow is still there. I don't know what it's doing. <laughs> so the orc skeletons, they removed. I saw the screenshots. I remember that. Yeah. We okay. have the IDs. Oh, we have the IDs. Okay. More Very than. good. I think I promised him a raffle if we didn't get it done in two minutes, and it was three minutes. So raffle? We have to do a one. Or let me one. create the items first. And I'll let you create the items first. I'm done, basically. <laughs> okay, let's do a small one. Okay, you won. You lost. Give away. Give away time. Whoop, whoop. Okay. So, let's start, I think. Start, right, yeah. raffle. Go, go, They're already go. doing. <laughs> You mentioned it once again. <laughs> <laughs> you need to say it, right? Okay. <laughs> I think that's enough. Okay. Okay. Maybe Prince is in there again. Renuk. Congratulations, Renuk three. Let's roll again. Roll again. Loot. Lutens. Lutens is a winner. And we need. Oh Zilu, yeah. The HC. Uh, congratulations, <laughs> the HC. <laughs> you are a winner. One more. Yes, one more. Nicolas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Congratulations. Really one more, then we have five. Really creative. Five <laughs> is good. Five is good. Yuki Uzagi. Reminds me of Sailor Moon. Okay, that's it for this round. Let's show the congratulations room to the five winners, and we can finally show you the room system. So you pull in your weapon. You will also see the um, probabilities of all steps now, or um, then also for the fifteen, because for the um, equipment and specialist cards, it was hidden. That was changed here with this system. So you need some materials and some gold. The gold yeah. demand is not so high. In the beginning. Is it difficult to get uh, the materials? No, it's really easy to farm them, but we just don't have the time yet. <laughs> yeah. And the runes are shown here in the new oh, icon. Show it, and yeah. you can even see it on the weapon that there are carved runes, one from 15. Oh yeah, okay, show a bit. What did you get now with the level one? My maximum rune? MP is increased by 1%. Okay. okay. Um, the That's funny thing, or the, the good thing is with the runes is you can always reset it. The reason for that is because if you hit this effect again, then it will be increased. So you will have 2%. Compete. So if you duplicate, if you get the same effect twice, it actually stacks up. Yeah, correct. That's cool. What happens if you have an effect you don't like? You can re remove, remove, remove the, yeah. but you have to remove all effects then. Mm. So think about it first, be careful. 
Oh, your materials are gone. Ten percent chance. Oh, you were <laughs> lucky, I would say, <laughs> or unlucky. Yeah. So gold is now sixteen thousand. Okay, what did you get? Now the defense powers are increased by twenty. Oh, nice, nice. So you can get up to how many abilities in here? Fifteen. Fifteen. So actually, fifteen effects. Unless you have duplicates, then it adds up on yeah. the same effect. Let's check if the other items are the one I need here. I hope so. <laughs> we have to create materials again. Looks good. Someone says it's gonna be very stressful. Yes. No, that was <laughs> the wrong item. I need the Dear. magic divine crystal. Oh, there was. There is a number already. Yeah. Maybe it's that. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. Yeah. Let's do some more. Yeah, we also added all the. Sh we asked Enfold to Can add all the shops. Can you use runes on all weapons? Um, we have a minimum limit there of level eighty weapons. So your weapon has to be level 80 or waking level. Mm -hmm. And only main weapons can be carved with runes. Someone is asking if the weapon can be destroyed. No. There's just either the chance of the that it, there is a success or it fails and the material is destroyed. Or actually the weapon is fixed. Out of the fixed. Yeah, you cannot. You need a special item for that to remove the fix. Okay, so now we're at 55,000 gold and more material. Oh, I think we already have the special... Yeah, we already have a special power. Oh, we got a special power. Oh, let's look at it. Because the normal rune effects are... How to say... Um, passive skills. And with the rune powers, you have some active skills, some buffs, which you are giving by wild attacking. Can you show it? In this case, we have a 1% chance to give frost power to the enemy giving another effect. Uh, it's behind our heads again. Forget about it. <laughs> okay. Can you guys see it? The effects that we just got? Ruffle, ruffle, ruffle. <laughs> Stop saying it. <laughs> I know it was behind our heads. Sorry. We keep forgetting. We are here. It's our first okay. time. Please be patient. Okay. <laughs> So yeah, you, 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 if you attack, you have a 1% chance to give an effect of all enemies within three spaces. So if you're uh, attacking a group of enemies, all of them within th uh, three spaces will give, uh, get the effect. Okay, let's try to upgrade one more time. Or as many times as you have gold or materials. You have a lot, enough gold for now. Yeah. <laughs> materials are consumed. Okay. There's I mean, also the fail probability is now at 49. This yeah. is uh, getting diff more difficult, right? And of course you hit it. Okay, success. What do we have now? The maximum HP is increased by 200. So we have different effects. So we have percentage, like MP is increased by 1%, or we have fixed values, like M HP by 200. There is a lot of different effects. Yeah. How many did you? <laughs> uh, let me check. I'm failing too much. I wrote down nine abilities, but I'm not sure if we changed that with the balancing stuff already. No, I think we didn't change the amount, just the effects of it, because they were way too strong in the beginning. Right. Ooh, now it's so there's ten types of rune power. Now my weapon is damaged. Cool. I can then upgrade again. Let's try again with another. So this is now the the, the mage, right? Let's yeah. try the swordsman. But the weapon can still be used. It's not that it's not usable anymore. You, you just can just cannot item. carve more runes right. on it. Yeah. I want to see what the swordsman or swordsman my favorite class. Look at that outfit. It's so awesome. 
Oh. A small message to Nicholas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Your chat is set to private. If you would like to have your code, please message our moderators. Otherwise, you don't get a code. Okay. Will the runes make the weapon exclusive to the player? The runes can only be used on either weapons which are bound to you already with Perfum or to clean weapons, then they will be bound afterwards. So yeah, it's the same with shells basically. The shells are something separate shells. The shells will be the same because with awakening experience the shells are on max level so they won't change the effects or the effects won't be higher. But for the new weapons you will also have the rune system for Act 7. So it should yeah. be powerful enough already. Someone asked for the other two raids, but I think we should show the tattoo system before. Yeah. Uh, so we show a bit the rune system, then we go to the tattoo system. And if there's some more time, we can also show you the two other raids. Should we also show maybe those darker maps? Or should we keep it and shouldn't spoil everything? What do you think? If we are not scared, we can go there. <laughs> we have God mode, right? What yes. do you mean? Ah, because it's dark and scary? Yeah, it's dark and scary. And orcs don't want to go there. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we're here to help them, right? <laughs> Failed again at 10%. I'm so lucky today. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, let's look at what you got. So you got the to same as before, um, yeah. almost. <laughs> yeah, but there are more effects. But this time you didn't get like a power. The power is on the third level, the sixth level, oh, and the right. ninth level. Can you try again for the third level? Let me let's see. Items. Oh, your materials are gone. Yes. Because you wanted the sword, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know, I'm in. I'm, I'm, I like the swordsman. Yeah. Who doesn't? I used to be a Nostad player before I started to work for Gameforge, and my private character was actually a swordsman, swordswoman, whatever. <laughs> I think currently the Nostad team, all of us were almost Nostad players before, so. Everyone sitting in this room, yeah. or four people, all of us started as Nostad players. So we're having some experience. Of course, we can't know everything, so we will hear to the it's feedback behind we are giving. our heads again. To open the game. So now we have the wolf power there. It's giving a bad debuff. effect debuff to the other player. All element energies are reduced yeah. by 495 player level times five. So if you want to have other effects, you have to reroll the runes, so you have to start from zero again. Can you show? With the right item I could. <laughs> okay. Okay, then this was the rune system. Let's move to the tattoo system. <laughs> so, yeah. So the tattoo system, actually, the tattoos give you new skills. So again, you need to form some materials and then you can create the twos and those can give you uh, like two new buffs that can be used as skills. You can upgrade them to level nine to be more powerful. There's two, tif you already showed, go back to oh. the design. So there's four different not behind our heads? No, it's not. Okay, I can't see. I'm tall, but. <laughs> <laughs> There's four different kinds of tattoos. It's like the lion. the lion, the eagle, the bear, right? Yeah. And, and the, the snake. snake. And they you all can only have one of each. Yeah, you need like to decide yeah. what you want to go for. So you can't have two of the lion tattoos. You can have a lion and the eagle, for example. And they have different abilities yeah. and specialties. The tattoos are shown here in the skills. There's a new window. Where do you open it? Show again. Oh, okay. That's where oh, you're opening oh, yeah. the skills. So it's a new tab basically yeah, new in tab. the skill info. Okay. 
You can see the skills here and you can move them into your skill bar later to use them as skills. As skills, yeah. They're buffing yeah. you, they're having a nice visual effect that you can show to other players as well. Let's show. Yeah. Let we me check. We need the production scroll first. And some materials as well. Yeah. But first the tattoo patterns of one of the four different. So while we're getting the items, we can do another raffle. Don't don't say it, no. Why not? Please be louder. Okay, I will try my best. Okay. <laughs> No, it's for me. You oh, yeah. Probably loud I enough. am very obnoxious, so it was probably <laughs> not directed at me. <laughs> right. Okay, let's do another raffle. Okay, start. Raffle, 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 raffle. Nerf mage, nerf mage. Raffle, raffle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's stop. We will roll. Nolasia, congratulations. Oh, this oh, is oh wait, sorry, see. we didn't move. Now, congratulations, you won a code. Another one? Another, of course. Ripros T15, you are a winner. Paiaccio, you also won a code. Congratulations. Let's roll some more. Some more. Mysterio385, Mysterio. you want a code, we will contact you. Another one. I cannot pronounce that, but you also want a code. <laughs> Another one. Miko Ita. Miko Ita, congratulations. One last one, guys, and then we will show you the tattoo system in more detail. Mm -hmm. Honored Ryuken, congrats. That is it. You're honored with a hmm? coupon. He's honored with a coupon. You are honored <laughs> with a coupon. Probably a pet or the tropical costume, kind of fitting to the new maps, I would yeah. say. Right. Okay. Let's start with the tattoo. Yeah, you basically have to create the scroll first by farming the materials. Uh, most of them are gained from the raids, or not most of them. But I, th yeah, I think most of them can get there, but also from normal monsters. And afterwards, if you have to scroll, you can carve the tattoo. Uh, tattoo. And we need more materials, of course. <laughs> the bone powder and the, the spirit forest, forest branch. And the and the third, uh, the last one too. Look at it. Yeah, it looks like a diamond stuff. Divide it a bit. That that's not a name from the. Oh, <laughs> and the golem core. That's also from the raid, which we did before. Oh, that uh, yeah. That's Most right. of them were dropping there, actually. So yet you can put the runes on all equipment starting level 80, right? On main weapons. Main weapons. main weapons, yeah. all main weapons starting level 80. It doesn't have to be an Act 7 weapon. Yeah. That's why we also started with the, um, or reduced the entry level to 85, because then you can even go to Act 7, if possible, with friends, farm some materials and carve tattoos on your weapons, maybe. Or you can also trade with other players. How will it be possible to get new weapons? Um, the two lower sets are um, gotten in the in the raids. You can get them there in the, from the raid box. And the highest equipment has to be crafted out of the low equipment and the scroll and some materials, of course. Okay, okay. Yeah. So what are you doing now? I'm carving a tattoo of bear. The bear lower. Is there a nice animation to it? I think so, right? It is. <laughs> For the tattoo, at least. <laughs> We didn't see it. No, I did not use it yet. Oh, yeah. As I said, it's like a skill. You can oh, you put it into your skill, skill bar. To see it. Yeah. Okay, mm. what did you get to show us? So. It's a defense buff. My defenses are increased by 10% for 8 seconds. So it's a short buff, but it can oh, help. Oh, it's the cooldown. The cool time is 180 seconds. Yes. Right. 
it's with the most of the tattoos that they have a lot of cooldown, but 10% is not that. Yeah, it's, it's a lot actually. But you can upgrade these. Yeah, you can also upgrade them. And once you upgrade them, this the will effects are higher. Uh, way higher and more yeah. powerful. Oh, you used it? Yeah, but that should not happen. We have this bug also on live. <laughs> is it like a. Ah, the yeah. UI is not shown. It's not fixed yet. We will report it again. So and here in the third tab, you can upgrade your tattoo. So Act 7 will be released in December. You might have seen the Christmas decoration in Noswell. That is kind of a hint, right? <laughs> so it will probably be before Christmas. Let's do another tattoo. Look at them only wanting the, the word I should not say, you know? Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> You just have to think about it. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't. You got a new tattoo design? Which one do you have now? Now the snake. The snake, Loa. Is it the same materials as for the lion? Yes. Or the bear, you have the bear. Also, the effects are similar. I mean, they're a bit special for each pet, like the bear and the snake and so on. But most of the effects are similar to each other. But as we said, you can just have one out of each category. Like okay. one bear, one, okay. one snake. Okay, what did you get now? You got the... Uh, there's a 100% chance of causing curse power. What yeah. is curse power? Every time when you receive a debuff, there's a 5% chance, which can be um, increased by upgrading the two, that every element is being increased by 10%. That's a buff for you. It's a positive effect. And it's doing it again. <laughs> hmm. You can update each of these skills up to level 9. Right? Yeah. Or is it level 10? No, it's level 9. It's level 9. We have to wait a bit. So. For the cooldown? Yeah, for the cooldown. Oh. Uh, you mean it's raffle time again? <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid, yeah. <laughs> See, I already said it. Now we have to do it. We have some more codes. Let's throw them out to the people. Okay. So. Start. Oh, that was a nice wing. <laughs> now they're gone. Mm. So how are you doing? How do you like our stream so far? It's the first one. I'm still a bit nervous, but I like it. I'm having fun. Yeah, users are really nice. And also Act 7 is really nice. It's cool to show it. Yeah. Let's wait a bit more. They like to write this word anyway, so. Yes. <laughs> Okay. Stop it. Uh, did you change the mode? Yes. Good. It's visible. Very good. Let's roll the winners. FIFO Robot, I like your nickname and you want a code. Extra 96, you also won. Congratulations, you will be contacted. Sue so you. So you, right? you don't have to write rattle, uh, raffle anymore. It's you. It doesn't. Yeah. You don't have to say it. They okay. will do it anyway. Roll. Skin tags. This. Thank you for having such an easily pronounceable <laughs> nickname. Dark Tema. Dark Tema. Okay. One more. One more. Last one. Let's roll it. Kimino. 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 Kimi Okay. Unders underscore. <laughs> underscore. Thanks, guys. This was it for now. All right. So, so we have done. the cooldown done. We can show you again the tattoo skill. Let's upgrade uh, it. Upgrade now. first. Before we had 10% chance. Now it's plus one and we have a 11% chance. Right. But with every upgrade it level, will it will increase. Let's see how lucky I am. Um, this one can also fail, as you have seen, not seen yet, but you will see probably now. It can have a success, then it's upgraded, and it can have a major failure. That means the upgrade level is decreased, decreased. again. Okay, 12% now. Let's see. 50. Oh, sorry. 
Oh. Now it's a yeah, it's reduced again, so I have plus one instead of plus two. We could play this game all night. The sound <laughs> like sounds the sound like, yeah. It's very <laughs> interesting. Oh, plus three. Plus three. Let me. How yeah. much is it now? Should be 13, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that's. Plus one by every. Okay. We need more material. Sorry. Are well, you want to upgrade more? I would try one or two more times, maybe. Can you use the buffs while the SP is on? By buffs, you probably mean the skill? The tattoos? Yes. Yeah. You can use them there too. It's basically like the, the, like the skills from pets and partners, which you can s use all the time. Use the skill. I'm afraid it's broken again because maybe I have to restart the client, but... What do you mean? This. Oh my god. Yeah. But it's gone. It's gone, yeah. <laughs> well, we have to fix that before releasing it, I would say. It's an old bug, actually, sadly. It's still not found by Android yet. You but can maybe we found a trigger now to tell them, like, hey, check it with the tattoos. Someone asked how many upgrades you have for tattoos. It's nine. Yes, plus nine. So with the base values, it's basically ten. Because you start with zero and going to nine. Right. So that means the defense I had now on the bear tattoo could go up to 20. Because it starts with 10. No, to 19. Yeah, to 19. Oh, is it? Have you the list there? I don't have the list. Oh, uh, oh I have it actually on my phone. Because with the higher levels, the increasement is it's more. I think so. <laughs> I have it. Wait, wait, wait. While you do something, I will look for it. I can't do that much, but. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no, can't open it. But no like problem. We we will post guides about all the uh, the new systems and the equipment. So you'll be able to get information, more details on this very, very soon. Oh, how oh, level? Plus one. It's the oh, other the one. other one you upgraded. Because you have to wait for the cooldown. Yeah. Okay. See, it's already 7.30 p.m. But we can keep going a bit more, right? Yes, we can. I we think. Uh, announced one and a half hours, but um, someone wanted to see the other two raids. So we're just going to jump right into them. Mm -hmm. We can also show you the tower now, if I can go there with this character. <laughs> no, I can't. Uh, we will have a second code for everyone. You have the list there. But um, we, hmm? we will, there's issues with the Nosmo, so you will not be able to redeem it right now. Let me check this list. If we can't give it to you in the stream, we will post it for you, the second code we have uh, on social media. So we're in the Sky Tower now. Oh, nice. I cheated inside because he... Want, didn't want to let me pass. <laughs> what are those monsters? Those are evil orcs or corrupted orcs. They were corrupted by that evil monster that came out of yeah. the sky. So those are the highest monsters here in Act 7. Not, not the orcs, but in the sky tower. Level 97. Yeah. And what Entro also did now is interesting. Um, oh no, that was the wrong port. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, let's go this way. It's better. Uh, what Enfil also did now, um, one of the raid bosses is level 100. So that's over the level cap of the players, actually. Good. That could be interesting for some of the Good. effects, like which are meant like if the monster is higher than your level and so on. What are those? Ooh, so like maybe that. we will see more in the future like that. Look, she's wearing something like... Yeah, like, like you, me? but it's just in purple. But it's <laughs> similar, it's similar. And with a skull, I think. Yeah. Well. You have five of those floors where you can level. This is out of my notes, so. No, cheat. 
Oh, I have a map. Of oh, we could even check here. No, we can't. This one is de more detailed. <laughs> I will not show you. <laughs> oh, yeah, this one. Uh, B1, B2, B3, mm -hmm. B4, and B5. Yeah, I'm going and to this be is where the, the final raid boss is, right? B5 is the pre-map of the raid, where you can also drop the raid tiers like this. If you kill the monsters, which are called Belial something here, you can drop a Belial seal. Oh yeah, so you need to fight those yeah. or time space, right? Or the time space. The drop okay. chance on the monsters is not that high, so you have to farm a bit. But in time spaces, it's really high. If you go in there, it's I think it's like a 50% chance. So you don't need that much luck. <laughs> Just some time to farm the seals. Uh, they're asking if the raid is open for everyone or if it's like a family raid. You know, the raid is open for everyone. You can drop the seals. Just the leader needs the seal. You can invite the team. Ah, that's also interesting now what we change or asked Entra to change. You can only enter the raids by awakening level 10. So if you put the raid into the raid list, no one from Nosville can join there who can't join Act 7 later. And with Act 6, that was some kind of problem because you didn't know if all players were teleported to you from your raid team. But with Act 7, that won't happen again. What we also changed, I mean, Antwil actually told us it's a bug, but we asked him to leave it in there to use the summon stone for your raid team on those maps. Yeah. And what we also changed before, it was like the team was teleported to the whole map, like divided everywhere mm. randomly. And now we changed it that the team is teleported to the raid leader here on those maps. Mm. So there is the entrance That's to the highest raid. Belial. Belial is the guy that corrupted the chief of the Orc tribe. Is that right? Is that? Let me check for the... Oh, there's a question. The removal is only there to change the tattoo, correct? If you found out like you didn't want or don't want the tattoo anymore, you want to try something else because the effects are also random. You don't know which tattoo you're getting. So you need a special item to remove the tattoo again to get another effect. Let me check. Because I was unlucky to drop the seal. I will do it manually. <laughs> this rate is this a very rate. lonely rate. Yes, it's for 20 players. It's the highest rate now. And the maps are really nice. Do you have god mode? I have god mode to not die, but I won't kill the boss instantly. Okay. It will take a while anyway, because... Because yeah. you know if you die... <laughs> Damn. Die <laughs> no, 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 no. Not again. <laughs> so as you can see, the red boss is level 100. That's new for Nostril so far. What's his specialty? The raid bosses. Hmm? What What's his specialty? Meteors? We was, he's star. spawning a lot of monsters around him who are helping. So you need a team of 20 members. And spawning oh. meteors. Hmm. What, are, what are those things doing? Those dark portal... You have to kill them. Otherwise they are doing damage. As you can see... I, oh. <laughs> How much damage did you get? 5,015. That's 6, a lot. 8,000, 11,000. I have resistance, but he's still doing a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah, the squares are a graphical bug. The client just has to be repaired, so this was already fixed. You would be, like, already dead a hundred times if yes. you didn't have <laughs> Aren't I you swordsmen? You're not a good tank, I must say. No, don't you. So what can you get from him when you defeat him? Here you can get uh, the scrolls for the final equipment for the highest one. Mm. So is it like, because we have three new main equipment, three new secondary uh, weapon, mm -hmm. and also armor, so this means each raid gives you one new equipment piece? Correct. Okay. I mean, the lower rates, both of them are giving 
all uh, both of the smaller equipment pieces, like two, two swords, two armors, two daggers, and so mm -hmm. on. Um, ah, I get it. But the last one you only get here. Yeah, sure. It's not spawning monsters yet. Thankfully. <laughs> <laughs> Don't kill it yet. I want to see some monsters. Where are the monsters? Not here yet, I don't know. Maybe he don't want to show us the monsters. <laughs> but basically they are the same as on the on the map, pre map before. I see. Yeah yeah. Just a few of them. <laughs> a few. Okay. Oh, there are some. But now it's over mission clear. Congratulations, Tommy. Thank you. Which rare level do I have? Rev 3. That's okay, it's dropping the same stuff or yeah, different stuff? All raids are dropping the same stuff. So you can always farm for your tattoo and, and rune stuff. Yeah. And gold, of course, which is also needed there. Important, yeah. yes. So we will post some guides for you guys in the upcoming days about the different systems, the equipment. So we will share details before we actually release oh. the update. What did you I get? I have a production scroll, that's good. Because this scroll is used for the high level equipment and I can show it directly. Oh, nice. Well, it's a secondary weapon you got? Yeah. And here you can craft a level 60 secondary weapons, all of them. And as you can see, you need a lot of materials the from champion the champion level rates. 60. Yes, champion level. Okay. You need, need a lot of materials. Also, the king horns from the first raid, from the dog. Mm, the the non-dog. Yes, and the low le lower level equipment. It's actually a lion from the dog, yeah, mm. with wings. But it's the same as for Act Six uh, equipment. When you craft it, you have the chance to either leave the same shell effects on the equipment or to get new shell effects on it. You can re-roll them. What's the most fun? part for you about Act 7? What do you like most? I like the most that it's again, we have two systems now where you have to farm um, materials again to to increase your powers. You don't need that much in the beginning, uh, but you can also go really high if you farm a lot and have a lot of yeah time, <laughs> actually. <laughs> but it's really fun in my And eyes it gives also. a lot of, you know, possibility for individualization. That's true, yeah. Really you can new, decide on your own if you skills, have new active yeah. skills, new effects. Yeah. Also for weapons that are outside of Act 7 actually, which is pretty cool. Yeah, yeah true. The guides for the storyline yeah. and the equipment are already live. You can see them already. Nice. Maybe you have seen them already. Right. But there will be more for the tattoo so and rune system. Yeah. Check out the equipment guy on the website. Yeah. So just the other raid. Do you want to show it as well before we do a? What yeah, you can see there. Nothing. <laughs> yes. 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 Let's do it. And then we will wrap up shortly. So let's do the last raid. Mm -hmm. After that, we do our last raffle. Oh no, I said it. I said it. I said no. it. I said it. <laughs> Which map is it? B6. So the Beast King, right? No, I'm wrong here. Definitely. <laughs> it's too small. You are in Act. Welcome to our Act 5 live stream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. My favorite part of Act 7 is that little, little pudding, I think. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, the old bear is really nice. <laughs> there it is, the crazy like old bear. I like it. That's also a map, as we can, s uh, as we said, on all pre maps you can farm the raid seals. We added them to some monsters, the higher ones actually. But if you farm there, you will get some automatically. We wanted to do the 
our first or <laughs> the no, raid no, first? No, no, we do the raid first. Okay. And the raid seal for the beast, Carno. Our dear supporters in the background, please create I can or give us it. the no. item ID. Oh, this one minus two. <laughs> oh, makes sense. Look at them like no, spamming. Almost. Yeah. Kano. Kano. Yeah. Ka Kano. Mm -hmm. It's also for eight people. That's the lowest rate, I would say, the easiest one for now. But we will also deep uh, look deeper into that. So that's not too hard and also not too easy. I don't know if I have gotten both. I hope so. So what kind, what is it? It's a lion wing horn. It's a high level so monster. It's a horned <laughs> lion wing. Yeah. There's also a white version in the time space where you can farm this. Oh ah, yeah, yeah. It's a boss, huh? Yeah. So I like the owl bears. Yeah. How does Antwo come up with these things? It's awesome. I think this time it was um, used from the mobile game, which we also tried here already. Oh yeah. They use some of the assets again, which makes sense because yeah. why not? <laughs> so we actually traveled to Korea in June, and I think, to yeah. visit Antwil and to talk about Act Seven and the changes for Act Six. To make sure everything turns out great for you guys this year. He's jumping a lot. Where is he going? He's, he's trying to land on you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You have a blackout. Again, stop it. <laughs> so, he also spawns stuff, obviously. He jumps a lot around. And he has also a damage reflection shield. Wow, that was fun. Lucky. There's a 90% chance to not get my blackout, and he got it. <laughs> ah. Oh, yeah, there's the damage reflection. Reflects the maximum from 5,000 damage. Is it a buff or a debuff? It's a buff it's for a buff. the boss, and oh, yeah. reflecting my damage back to me. No. Rapport. What did you get? Material. Jade. It's also for the tattoos and the runes. True, what we also, for the runes, you will also need something from Act 6. Just as a small spoiler. Hmm. What material? <laughs> you know? Do you want to say it? No. I don't know how to. No, how to it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I guess that was it for today. Other. Of course, we didn't forget about you, the last raffle we will do. Ah, oh, there are some more. If you press MSX7, yeah. Yeah, they changed it. The X7 map is there now without text, but we are still on it. And X6 is also there. X6 part 1, X6 part 2, and X7 with all the maps. The Awakening level 45 bow. Yeah, as we said, from level 85... Or oh, level 80 plus, you can ruin every equipment. So awakening level, you can ru uh, ruin all of them. Mm -hmm. There's no limitation. But yeah. And yes, you can lose champion XP when dying. Yeah. Okay. I think they're all waiting on the raffle. It's pretty obvious, I would yeah, say. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay, guys. We're almost done. This will be our last raffle for today. So we just throw out, what do you say, 10 codes? 11. <laughs> 11 codes. Okay, start. Right, raffle in the chat. Your last chance to get a valuable single use code. Bushy is excited for X7. <laughs> and for the codes. Yes. <laughs> for the codes. Don't break it, please. <laughs> 
Sorry, Bushy. Okay, stop. Thanks, everyone. Let's go home. No. <laughs> uh, 11 codes. Let's yes. go. Number one is Akiyoshu. Aki Congrats. Sacred Blade, 17. I was almost reading it like in French. Sacred Blade or something. <laughs> <laughs> I, I read scared. <laughs> Ferexley, congrats. Eight more to go. Yamek, you also won. Congratulations. Prin Princess. This, wow. is, uh, this is rigged. You're cheating. <laughs> wow. Bexy, 333. Three, three. You're a winner as well. Ferexley, again. again? How many okay. do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's roll some more because we can duplicate in here. Yeah. Another, another poor, poor guy. <laughs> now you're not any longer. <laughs> Oza. Oza, check. check. Roll it. Mad Bill Kier. One, two, three, four. Another one. Stone Chat. Casey. Yes. And two more because we had two people who two. won twice. Calendar, congrats. And the last winner for today is... Good luck for you. Kaito. Kaito, congrats. Number one. Okay, you will be contacted by our moderators in the background. So please wait until they contact you. Yeah. Okay. Want to open main? Oh. Okay. Thanks a lot, everyone. I think this is it for today's stream, right? Yeah. Unless there are more questions, but I don't think so. We. Oui. So, please note that we will do a second stream the day the update drops. So we want to go into the game together with you and just experience on the live servers the start of Act 7. As I said, a little spoiler, it will definitely be in December, so stay tuned for any news. So We'll be happy if you join us there and also at X enjoying X7 as much right. as we do. It's really awesome. So, yeah. Before you ask for the code for all, we will not drop it in the chat now. We will announce it to you. So check out social media. We will post the two codes in there and then you can redeem it in the North Mall. Oh yeah, this one we all didn't show. Yeah, because the shop is a bit mm -hmm. wonky True. with all the people <laughs> spamming the shop. <laughs> so check out our Nostail official Facebook. We will just drop the codes right there for you. Okay. I think that is, yeah. that's it. <laughs> Thanks today. everyone. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. See you for the next stream. I hope you had fun. I had fun. Me too. <laughs> cool. Let's do some more streams for us till then. Bye bye. Bye.